congratulations on the purchase of your new peg stilts. Before you go out and start having fun, you're going to need to attach your shoes, and in this video I'm going to show you how to do so. So go grab your shoes and a few tools. You're going to need a drill and a quarter inch drill bit, as well as a 7 16 inch wrench and a pair of pliers. To start, unlace your shoes and take out the footbed. I recommend not using gel cell shoes as this type of shoe creates a real mess when you drill into it. Next, you're going to place your shoe on the footplate. Make sure that you put the correct shoe on the correct stilt. As you can see in this photo, I have my right shoe on my left stilt. This is a common problem that people run into. Make sure that you have the correct shoe for the correct stilt before you start drilling. The stilt upper should be on the outside of your leg. When placing your shoe on the footplate, make sure that it is straight, the toe pointed forward, and the outside of the foot is close to the upper, almost touching. The most important part here is making sure your foot is pointing forward, not pigeon-toed or duck, but straight forward. Now grab your drill and we will drill the heel of the shoe first, drilling from underneath going up. Make sure to hold the shoe very well and not let it move as you start to drill. Start drilling slow to prevent this from happening. So now that you've got the hole drilled through your shoe, you might want to take your drill and just widen that hole up just a little bit and drill through it again. Now take one of the carriage bolts, whichever length will work best for the thickness of your shoe, and shove it down through your heel, making sure there's enough bolts sticking out underneath to put the nuts onto. You don't want to nut the bolt down now. Just put it through the shoe and through the footplate to hold the shoe in place. Now you will drill the toe. Again, make sure the foot is pointed straight ahead. Drill up through the shoe, being careful not to drill too far and into the tongue. Again, grab one of the carriage bolts and stick it through the toe. Now tighten the bolts on the shoe, starting with the heel and then the toe. Tighten it down good so that the bolt makes a depression in the shoe and sinks down just a bit. But not too tight though, we don't want the bolt to pull through the shoe. Make sure to double nut the toe and the heel bolts. Put your insole back in and you are almost ready to go stilting. The first time you stand on your stilts, have someone check the bolts that you have just inserted and make sure that the nuts are all tight. When you weight your shoes for the first time, it usually pushes the bolts a little bit farther down. Now grab some of your friends and go have fun. 